before I start this video, there are two DVDs that I forgot to include in my 2016 movie collection, which they are Bloodfather. And the whole truth. Both of these, by the way, are Lionsgate premiere movies. By the way, we put these in, out to the side. Now, and, and, and this time in this video, I will be showing y'all my 2018 movie collection. Which, I don't got really that much of, I don't really have a lot of them to show, but I still have a, I, have, I still have a pretty solid amount of 2018 movies, so let, let's go, let's go on and start this video. I do hope to get the girl with the dragon tattoo soon. By the way, this and... The last DVD I'm going to show are two movies that I have that have the newer Regency logo. Even though it's not shown on the back or the disc. But I do know that they do have the newer Regency logo. I remember I saw this one in theaters in 3D. I also did see the 30th anniversary re-release of the first Jurassic Park movie in theaters as well for National Cinema Day of this year. And and that movie still holds up. This one I also saw in theaters as well. The, the, I mean, this one I also liked as well. And, and, and I also have... Um, the first Jurassic World movie on DVD and the first Jurassic Park movie on VHS and the same movie, The Lost World, Jurassic Park, and Jurassic Park 3 on DVD. And I also have Jurassic World Dominion on Blu-ray. Never seen this movie yet. Very funny movie in my opinion. I remember I got this DVD at Dollar Tree a, a, a couple months ago this year. Another movie I saw in theaters back in um, December of 2018. No, I don't think it was December. I think it was um, October. I think. I I don't I don't even I don't even remember. Yeah, I don't think it was December of 2018. I, I think it was like two months uh, before. I do hope to get the sequel at sometime soon. And I have and I have seen this movie before for, for the first time this year. And this is a great movie. Oh, and by the way, Smallfoot though needs a rewatch. Oh wait. Yeah, I put the I put um a quiet place and small foot in the wrong order, but whatever I guess. Amazing movie right here. 
I did see Across the Spider-Verse, though, in theaters back in, um, back on, uh, June of this year, and that movie was just amazing as well. I actually like that one a little bit better than this one, though. But this one, though, is still a great movie. Here's the last DVD, and then we're moving on to the Blu-rays. And when it, and just like I said for The Girl in the Spider's Web, um, this is also another Regency movie that isn't shown on the back or the the disc. But I do but it does actually have the newer Regency logo. And now we're moving on to the four Blu-rays. I also do have the Tigger movie on DVD. I do hope to get the other Winnie the Pooh movie soon. That yeah, the, there was a little like thing on over here whenever I got this DVD. But I actually peeled it out because it was kind of hard for me to get the disc back into the um the little uh disc holder thing. But the disc though on the other hand still actually works though. So I'll still be keeping that movie. This one was brand new sealed whenever I got this at Goodwill a couple months ago. Showing this because it has the first Peter Rabbit movie from 2018. Which here's the disc for the first movie. Which which I honestly thought was pretty good in my opinion. But the sequel though I have not seen yet. Back on this insert is blank so I'm not going to bother showing it. And finally the last Blu-ray for this collection. Very good um, Marvel movie. Part of the uh, Sony Spider-Man universe. 